Hey, it's Janae with Daily Dental Hygiene, and today we are gonna talk about varnish. This is fluoride varnish. I'm sure your crazy hygienist has told you to put it on your teeth after your dental cleaning, and today I'm gonna explain to you why we tell you to put it on your teeth after your cleaning and the benefits of it. But first off, let's talk about even what is fluoride varnish. So varnish, just like you would put on your furniture, is something that coats, right? So the varnish coats our teeth and it sticks to our teeth. The fluoride in fluoride varnish is a high concentration and it is very, very, very effective against cavities and sensitivity. So a lot of people don't know this, but when you're born, you're born with actually all the enamel you're ever gonna have. Teeth start forming at about like five to seven weeks in your mom's stomach. And so when you're born, you have all the enamel you're ever gonna have. So after your dental cleanings, it's important to coat your teeth in fluoride varnish so that we keep your teeth mineralized, which will help protect against cavities. So why should you put this on your teeth after the cleaning? So once you've gotten your teeth cleaned, you know, we've, we've gotten off all the plaque, the bacteria, the staining, your teeth are a beautiful blank canvas to then put on a remineralizing substance to kind of seal in everything. Plus, when you clean your teeth, sometimes you can expose areas of your root surface, which can lead to sensitivity, and varnish is incredible with sensitivity. So varnish is one of those things that sometimes they put on your teeth and don't really tell you what you should do with it after. It's like, now my mouth is all sticky, and now what? So when your hygienist or your dental professional puts varnish on your teeth, it's important to have the best uptake. So if you put this on your teeth, but you don't do the correct post-op instructions, you're really not gonna get the full benefit out of it and it's kind of a waste. So number one thing is nothing hot, nothing crunchy. No hot soup, no hot coffee, no hot tea, nothing super, super, super hot that it melts it off your teeth. I say nothing crunchy like tortilla chips or something super abrasive. You don't wanna scrape it off of your enamel. Um, the number one thing that I see patients do is brush their teeth right after I already coated their teeth in this. So you just took off all the good ingredients. So keep it on as long as possible. If you get your teeth clean done, cleaning done in the morning, uh, if you get dental work done and then they put on the fluoride varnish, keep it on all day long and brush it right before you go to bed. The longer it sits on your teeth, the better uptake it has the less likely you are to get cavities and sensitivity. So I know sometimes it can feel sticky and weird and tacky and you don't prefer it. I understand that. It's just for one day. Try to keep it on the best that you can. If it is sticking to your lips, which I know is super frustrating, get a little bit of chapstick, get a little Vaseline and coat your lips on it and the stickiness will go away. But Always use fluoride varnish, you know, if you're ever experiencing sensitivity and absolutely after your dental cleaning so that you can keep those teeth as long as possible and you don't have to deal with cavities and sensitivity.